Riverside Tappahannock Hospital, we have one simple mission. Care for those we serve as we would those we love. We're making a difference by building a better place to heal for our community. The Northern Neck, Middle Peninsula, and beyond. The community actually built the hospital. The town officials, the county officials all came together. Then Riverside bought it and it, it just blossomed overnight. This is a community hospital. I think it's very important that the community looks at what they can do maybe to help here. Since 1969, it's been a partnership between your community hospital and you. A promise to offer the most advanced, most effective treatments and technologies available, to deliver cost-effective, high-quality care, and to respond to ever-changing health care needs. The hospital has just given so much back to the community, so much back to our each individual lives. I'm sure all of us have either been to this hospital or we've had others, loved ones that have come here for its care. I think it's very important to have a resource like this in the community. And I learned a long time ago from a mentor of mine that you can't just take from the community, you have to give back. Our bank realizes what an important part of the community Riverside Tappanic Hospital is and has been. What you give to Riverside really helps to develop the hospital even further. It is really important for us as citizens to recognize the value that this hospital brings to our community. Now is the time to look at the next phase. If we don't keep up with the technology that's out there, we will become behind in terms of the delivery that our citizens deserve and expect. I just can't comprehend what this area would be without our hospital. So I think it's, we're at a point in time when we need to, to step back and reflect and say what can we do to, to help this great organization and healthcare system we have. For decades, the Riverside Health System has invested into making this community-based and nonprofit hospital a state-of-the-art medical facility. Modern updates to our emergency room and surgical suites have allowed us to provide specialized treatments using the most advanced equipment available today. Now, in partnership with the Riverside Health System, we have launched our building a Better Place to Heal capital campaign to finance the conversion of our currently outdated multi-patient rooms into single-bed, fully modernized, all-private rooms. We consider this project to be transformational for Riverside. It's not just a matter of um, having one bed in, in a room versus two in a room. It's really changing our whole uh, environment of how we deliver inpatient care. This would be converting the rooms to what you would expect uh, in today's day and age going into a, a newer hospital. Having semi-private rooms, I think that was um, something back in the 60s and 70s and 80s that were expected. But now, I just can't imagine having a roommate if I have a serious health issue. I want to be in the room with the privacy of my own family, with my own doctors and health care providers there with me. As a physician, when I walk into a room to see a patient either in the emergency department or in the hospital, having the privacy of a private room allows me to care for that patient in a much more intimate and personal manner. There's things that the physician needs to find out in order to care for you. There's things that are said that you don't want people knowing, and you want patients to feel comfortable telling you things about themselves. The physicians who are practicing here in this community come here for a variety of reasons. Most often it's because they want to come close to the water and enjoy living um, in this beautiful area. These are well-trained physicians with great experience who bring state-of-the-art skills. And it is their expectation that their hospital will be able to support the type of work that they want to do and the type of care they want to provide for their patients. They strongly believe that the, the conversion to private rooms is an important and critical piece of our ability to do that. The best physicians expect the best facilities, and that's what we're building here at Riverside Tappahannock Hospital. To make this campaign a success, we need help from the entire community. The return is the best possible care, safety, and the most advanced medical technology close to home. Riverside Health System will match dollar for dollar the community's investment of $2.5 million, ensuring that for generations to come, our community and all our patients will benefit from this state-of-the-art renovation. Yeah, Riverside Tappahannock Hospital uh, is a non-profit hospital. The benefits of being non-profit 
is that those uh, profits that are made in the hospital are directly invested back in the facility uh, to improve it and to improve the, the health care. After all, the mission of the hospital and the reason we're here is to provide better health care for the, for the community and the people we serve. In our private room campaign, we pride ourselves on the fact that the physicians and the staff have led the charge. We have stepped up and put our money where our mouth is, if you will, to really make sure that this thing gets off the ground. The reason is that we believe in the importance of this and we believe in the care that we're uh, going to be able to deliver. We turn to the community now for that support as well because we believe that the community will embrace that uh, level of care that the private rooms will afford. When we saw uh, the request from Riverside, it was important to all of us that we join the campaign and do what we could do to help out. How would you have a community uh, that's as good and as strong as we have here in Tappahannock and in Essex County in general if we did not have a strong and vibrant health resource? And what great peace of mind that, that gives us all for our, our, my parents, my family, my grandchildren one day. All these, all this is so important to us. And I look at them and say, what if we didn't have it? And if we don't have it, what would happen? And they begin to realize how important it is that we continue to build this resource and how much that helps build the community. My grandmother used to always say, many hands make light work. And I think that's true in the fundraising capability too. The more people we have on board and in the project here, I think the quicker we'll be able to realize our goal. We want to upgrade our facilities to meet the, the state-of-the-art care of today. We've invested you know, millions of dollars in technology, much time, effort, and dollars in recruiting the finest physicians and the finest staff here to support the care delivery process that we want for this community. We want the facility to match that, and our community deserves that. Together, we can make a difference to our families and our community. Please join us in this important effort, and let's build a better place to heal.